Hello Aquarius, welcome back to Femacy Lighthouse. Thank you for joining me here today. In this reading, we're gonna be taking a look at the recent past, the present, and the future in reference to a love connection that continues to conflict you. To book your private reading with me, all of that info is below along with all of the price listings. And the best way to be notified as to when I put out any new content is by following me on Instagram. The link to my IG is below. And as always, not each and every Aquarius watching me is gonna feel like this is their message and that's okay. All right, let's get right into what's going on. Spirit, please speak to me in reference to the person that Aquarius is dealing with in the recent past. Please speak to me about the person that Aquarius is dealing with in the recent past. Talk to me about the person Aquarius is dealing with in the recent past, please. Whoa, okay. Just wanted to come out as well. Okay. So what I'm getting here is you may have had to set a boundary with someone. It could have to do with money, all right? Someone is having an issue here with paying the bills at home, okay? Um, it's like one person is doing more than the other or you may need some type of assistance financially. You feel like you're doing everything on your own and you want more help from this person. You're not putting them out or anything like that. But I feel like you're asking for someone's help here, okay? And I feel like there's a lot of drama at home. You could feel a little uncomfortable there at this time, all right? Tell me more about the recent past. Tell me more about the recent past and this person that Aquarius is dealing with. Okay. Yeah, there's drama here. A lot of arguing. There's like five people involved. Someone feels like just dropping the whole situation. And then we have difficulty with money again. I don't know if people are arguing over money or about who needs to pay what. Somebody just feels backed up against the wall when it comes to finances here. And someone is trying their best because there's like five kids in the house or um, there's five family members. It's like you're dealing with a group of people right now that are not seeing eye to eye or getting along with each other, whether it's your family members or somebody else. This group is at each other's necks right here. Talk to me about the present. Okay, so in the present, we have a Two of Cups energy. That's good. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Tell me more about this Two of Cups in the present. Talk to me about the Two of Cups in the present for Aquarius. Oh, okay, so <laughs> death card. So you feel like a connection needs to end, whether it be your connection or the connection of somebody else around you. It's like something is on the rocks here. You and your person, if you have somebody, you guys are not seeing eye to eye at all. Okay, that's what I'm getting here. Tell me more about the death card here. Pisces. Okay, so if you're dealing with a Pisces, then the Pisces could be giving you a hard time right now. 
clarify Pisces. Clarify this Pisces energy, please. Oh yeah. Pisces wants to walk away. Pisces doesn't want to deal with this shit anymore. I hear someone arguing, complaining here, and you can't stand that shit. Because you're not confrontational to begin with, Aquarius. So the nagging is not for you. Talk to me about the future when it comes to Aquarius. And yeah, it's difficult because there's money involved here. So it's not like you can just easily walk away from whoever it is that is not helping you. Or there's somebody that feels like they don't have money. Even if this is not in reference to your connection, somebody else's connection is lacking funds. Please clarify the King of Pentacles in reverse. Ooh. There's a commitment that is not doing well, okay? At all. Somebody's stuck. They feel like they have to stay there for financial reasons, that they can't leave because someone is the breadwinner here. The relationship is definitely on the rocks. Could be you or someone else. Let's clarify what the drama is all about over here. There's people arguing in the recent past here. Yeah, it's about an ending. It's about something that needs to change. Either you brought up what needed to change or they did and one of y'all didn't like it and there was an argument about it. Somebody's demanding for someone to do something. And the other party was like, nah. You know what I'm saying? And it, and it caused some type of friction between you and that person or other people. Clarify this Eight of Cups energy. Clarify the Eight of Cups energy, please. This fire sign here, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Somebody is walking away because they feel like this is too heavy. They can't take it anymore. It's like they want to go toward their wish and what it is that they really do want. Because someone here, whether it be you or the person that you're dealing with, somebody feels like this is not what they want anymore. But they feel locked in. They feel trapped. Clarify the Hierophant in reverse. Clarify the Hierophant in reverse, please. Yeah. It's like you can't leave. It's like if somebody wanted to go, they can't go. Even if they really wanted to, they can't leave because of financial reasons. Somebody supports the whole family or um, we have, you know, an authoritative figure here. This is a boss and they can't just walk away. And because of it, they're in this five of cups energy. What's the outcome here for Aquarius? Talk to me about the outcome for Aquarius, please. can't go anywhere you see you cannot go anywhere and it's irritating you or somebody around you can't go anywhere and they want to leave it's like they want to break free they want to break away and this pisces here or water sign is all up in their mind about this right here 
somebody wants to leave, whether it be you or your person, somebody had it here, but they can't go, so they're depressed. I'm getting heavily that this could be somebody around you. You're going to identify with this message the way that you receive it. You know what I'm saying? It's either you or someone around you. All right, let's get an angel card here. Spirit, please give me some advice for Aquarius. I knew that was going to happen. We're going to leave that over there, though. <laughs> okay. So we have the seven of Gabriel. Stand up for what you believe in. And you know who got this card? Sagittarius. If you go back and watch the Sagittarius reading, you're going to see that this angel card came out for Sag as well. So some of you guys are dealing with a Sagittarius here that's probably stuck and depressed because they feel like they need to stay at a place for financial reasons or something like that and they don't wanna be there. And it's weighing on this person. Somebody's depressed. All right, so go check out the Sag reading. I don't know if you're dealing with a Sag, but it says stand up for what you believe in. Have confidence and claim your personal power all right so it's time for someone to speak up here all right so that's what i have for you aquarius thank you so much for watching my channel to so book your private reading all of that info is below and take care